The heart gives a characteristic thump-thump as its valves close. Travelling in a double loop, blood is first forced to the lungs. Here, each red blood cell soaks up a precious cargo of oxygen and then returns to the heart. Next, the heart pumps blood on a longer journey into the rest of the body. Having returned to the heart through a vein called the vena cava, blood is drawn into the atria, the upper chambers of the heart. As pressure builds, the atria contract, forcing blood into the lower chambers, the ventricles. Next, the muscular walls on the right and left ventricles contract. Here we can see the left ventricle forcing blood out of the heart into the body's main artery called the aorta. Blood travels twice through the heart for each circulation it makes through the body. The heart is actually a double pump, simultaneously pumping blood from the right side of the heart to the lungs and from the left side to the rest of the body. It's the pressure of the blood itself that causes the opening and closing of these valves. Their colour tells us they're not richly supplied with blood. They have no muscles of their own. 